example, business leadership South Africa has called for government to lead by example in the fight against crime and corruption that dogs the country. CEO Busi Mavuso says government is creating a culture that says crime pays. You're sitting with the Speaker of Parliament at the moment who's actually sitting under a serious cloud. And a, 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 a decision is going to have to be made to say, do we keep, you know, uh, uh, the Speaker or do we actually move it? The right thing to do would actually be to move it. Because I think that sends a very strong message about the, 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 the tone that we take in as far as that crime is concerned. But the problem is that when it comes to corruption, South Africa's problem, you know, is a culture problem, a culture that has been set and cultivated from the top. The political culture in South Africa, unfortunately, Tammy, is that being accused of crime is not embarrassing. We have a culture that is conducive to theft. And if that is the culture at the top, what makes us as a country think that people won't follow suit? Because the message that we're sending from the top is that crime pays and nothing will happen to you and you can still hold a high political F office, you know, and better yet, you know, you continue to be given these positions. So we therefore are sitting with that problem. And I think when you look at it, you will see that countries really fall apart when governance fails at government level. And we are seeing governance really crumbling and failing at government level. So we are naive as a country to think that we can beat, you know, uh, 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 this issue and this pandemic really of crime and corruption when the right tone is not being set at the top.